is up guys welcome back to millionaire gaming so today we're playing some gta 4 for the pc and we're doing some more uh missions and it looks like we got a love icon hey 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 taxi taxi wait 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 taxi my god these taxi services suck man i'm like trying to get there and playboy is calling How did the big real estate deal go? That cat ain't got no vision. Wants to shut down the site and shit. Make it a memorial to union workers who died in accidents. And fuck you, Seth Armin. I got bigger problems. Come see me now. So it looks like we also have a Playboy mission. But Yusuf was actually on uh, Ballad of Gay Tony. Which is kind of cool. So where to? We're going to, to the date real quick, man. I, I gotta get there. Like... This is our, uh, you know, quote unquote first date, but, you know, then Michelle, you know, decided to screw Great, us. Thanks. And uh, let's uh, let's see what we could do in this said diner. All right, that must be him. Hey, are you my date? Thank God. You never know who's going to turn up when you've met someone online. Yeah, all sorts of sickos can use the internet. You have to be careful. I'm Nico. So, Nico, what do you do? I do a lot of things. What's your job? 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 Everyone's talking about this job guy. I haven't met him and I don't want to. Mr. Job sounds like an asshole. Really? So, what type of man he sounds do like he doesn't want to work. One with a lot you know? of money. Do you know Gay Tony? Runs Hercules and Mason at nine? I'll tell you a secret. He pretends to have the dollars, but he is broke as hell. The loser. If there is one thing that I all right, all right. out hot stuff, we haven't even eat your pack and heat. There you go. Easy and simple. Ah. That was the easiest and simplest mission ever. I think we'll uh well, looks like we gotta call Brucey first. Not so good. I don't think we'll be seeing each other again. I don't think he'll be seeing anyone. Mickey, you're an animal. Anyway, your profile's still up there, bro. There's all sorts of crazy pictures on that site you can get into. Real freak, you know? I'd be getting involved in some of that internet dating shit, but uh, I only date models, you know? Or VIPs who could be models. Not many of them online, yeah? Catch you later, big guy. Later. Well, that was an... A very interesting Where turn do, of events. Uh, let's see. I think we'll do Playboy to, to get it out of the way, and then we'll go, you know, casually up. I think we'll do Brucey next because that was Elizabeth's mission last time was there, horrendous. That was absolutely horrendous. Let's see what Playboy needs. The Holland play. What's up, money? Hey, man. Business is tough. Now, I ain't a cold person. I mean, I am cold, but motherfucker. What are you talking about? You want a drink? Uh, man, have a seat, man. All right. Now, I got into this dope game because it was the only thing that was open to me, man. The only thing, man. Hey, I am not judging. No, listen, now, I paid my dues. Now, I learned in a hard school, man, and I changed stuff. You know me. I do this stuff so I got a chance to do some good in this town. So you say. So I say. So I do. When I get the money, man, I will build parks. I will sponsor kids. I will save lives. But I got to have the money, man. Is all this... All this, it means nothing if you ain't got the heart, Nico. Amen, brother. <laughs> I mean, fuck, man. Fuck! The thing is, you know, Jesus, he did some crazy shit, too. I mean, everyone does. He killed people. He killed that John the Baptist cat. He did what he had to. I don't think you're correct about that. Man, the point is, man, history <laughs> is a long time. And you only got one chance. And Dwayne, man, 
Dwayne, it's like he thinks it's 1992, and the best that you could hope for is a gold chain and a pager. You know, he looks at me like he wants me dead. Now, I took care of business. I gave him money, but because I won't bow down to him and treat him like he the almighty, motherfucker wants to pop me. Dwayne is a little troubled. He was in prison a long time. Maybe you guys should talk. No, I tried talking. You know, I... I tried giving him half of the business. I tried everything a man could reasonably try and still call himself a man. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Kill him? Hey, I didn't say that. Man, you cold. I was joking. But what else is there? I mean, Cass been talking. Now I hear things. Said you and me, it's too tight now. Said you disrespected him. Called him mad. He's going crazy. I mean, he's gone. Prison does that. Well, you can't kill him. Nope. But you can. But I don't want to. Well, neither do I, man. But if he goes insane, we all dead anyway. I mean, Dwayne is a killer. Ah. Uh, I don't like this conversation. Do you think that I do? But it's kill or be killed out there. You got a lunatic after you? Man, you dumb. <coughs> now, I will give you a lot of money. Because see me? Now, I ain't scared of no one. But a motherfucker says he's going to kill me, the motherfucker's going to die. Hmm. Man, I'm not sure. I got to think about it. Well, I hope you see some sense. I will be in touch. Oh, man. This is actually the mission that I did not want to do. So, this one's one of those ultimatum kind of missions where you have to choose whether you kill Playboy or keep uh Dwayne and my choice is I'm going to you know keep Dwayne because Dwayne's cool I like Dwayne as for Playboy unfortunately he's he's gonna be the one that gets the boot but man that's a I got goosebumps from that I really should not and, um, oh my god Mallory what the fuck do you want Nico I heard that Michelle was a cop or a fed or something is it true I don't know what she is but she was lying to us all along, and now I'm paying for it. Nesta, there was always something funky about her. I'm real sorry. Hey, Brucey, what's up? <laughs> Hey, Nico B. Come here, show me the love man whoa, hug time. Enough, all right. Whoa, whoa, what are we about here, you and me? I don't know. What are we about, boy? Oh, I'm an immigrant and a hired gun, and you're a steroid junkie, but we get along. No, not that stuff. That's superficial. I'm talking about the real shit. What? We're winners, man. Fucking winners. That's how we roll, brother. Bling, check. Bodies, check. Paper, check. That's how we roll, bitches. The boss. Are you all right? Too much bullshark testosterone up the uh, ass? Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Hey, check this out. Lenny! Lenny! Is the bitch ready? Well, she's very shiny. Look at her. And we tears of pure gold. Motherfuckers. Come on now. Let's go show some people just how we roll. Yeah, all right. Come on, get in. Come on, start you. Shit. Pure gold, eh, big man? <laughs> Lenny, you're a fucking asshole. What is this? What is this? You two to yourself. Yeah. Well, what should I do? I mean, I need a flashy car. People are going to think I'm a no-nut bullshitter if I fail to deliver here. How about Steve's car? Yes. I'll call him on the way. Nico, can you drive us to Freetown Avenue and Willis? Yeah. Come on. Let's roll, bitches! Woo! Come on, Nikki, we need some wheels. No, that's actually kind of funny. Um, 
That was uh, a very cool car. That was a Banshee. And I remember that one from like the old like games. Aw, oh, you jerk. I like that suit, man. Looking snazzy, looking sharp. And it's okay. Of course, we, we get the car. Alright. That might be me not being a picky person, but if a person is a little bit thicker, I'm not really, you know, judgy. I'm a bigger person myself. I'm a big boy. And, uh, when it comes to, like, that stuff, it doesn't matter if you're skinny, fat, stuff like that. I'm not a, I'm not looking for no, like, model or anything, you know? I'm just, I'm just me. I just enjoy who, who I love. And, uh, here we are. Let's see what kind of car that is. Looks pretty nice. Hopefully we're got, not going to get into some kind of crazy crap. Oh, boy. Oh, of course it's a race. Fuck. Oh, I hate races. Oh, boy. I hate those things on these games. So when we get yeah. There, will you be driving? No way, man. I'm just here to look good. Me and you are cruising together. That's how we roll. Passenger side, flexing the guns, scoping the chicks, flashing the bling, pumping the sounds, riding shotgun, while my boy Nico pulls off some badass Red Army, pedal to the metal, skin of your teeth, burnt rubber moves. Am I right? Is that our style? Because I think that that is how we roll up in this shit. Man, I am fucking pumped today. Excuse me, could you go where you go? Here we be. You ready to feel the cheese? Whoa! The skin looks really rough, man. You had some help? A little, a little botulism special there? I like that, homie. You want a shot when we get back? I'm fine. Number one, good driving. How do I look? Pretty good, right? Yeah, pretty good. Take me back to my apartment, man. I'm feeling jacked. I want to hit the weights. Now. Well, at least we, uh, you know, obliterated that uh, race with ease. And you know thankfully, what, there's not a lot of people you can in there. This car. You earned it. And I can't have my boy rolling in anything but serious genetically different winter style, you know? I thought it belonged to Steve. Fuck Steve. You are the man, man. You are number one. You won this shit anyway. I'll give Steve the bitch. The bitch don't work too good. Don't worry about that. Brucey has the magic fingers. They only touch prime engines, hot models, no cellulite. Okay, VIP only. Read my lips. I'm a winner. And when they touch, shit, they work some serious magic, bro. What is it that you do, Brucey? Are you a mechanic? I don't get it. I'm a businessman. An entrepreneur. I make shit happen. Sure, but you seem kind of legit. Why you need guys killed? Of course I'm legit. You see my delts? That shit is as legitimate as it gets. What about these guys you need killed? Fuck, Nicky. You know Brucey. He's number one. It's lonely at the top. Sometimes the juice, it just takes control. Okay, red mist descends, and I need shit to happen to people. Are you talking about fucking roid rage? Is that why I killed those men? Oh, they were bad cats, Nikki. Maybe the juice meant I wasn't as uh, patient as I should have been. But you know, as a businessman, I can't let people get away with shit. I need to be firm. Look, Bruce, I like you, and I think we should hang out, but I don't want to work with you no more. I can't go around fucking people up because you've overdone it on the juice. Oh, all right, Nikki, man, I'm feeling you, okay? You don't want to let our business thing get in the way of our personal relationship. That's all good, man. Cool. Nikki, I feel like we really bonded back there. I'm close to you, man. You let me inside. You, you, you let your armor down, you know? We had a moment, man. Call me, and we'll hang. Sure we did. And unfortunately, our friendship goes to an end with Brucey.
Well, that sucks, because Brucey actually was a cool dude. And, um... I don't know. Can't remember. Do I... Do I call... Is it not... Not... Do I call Dwayne? I can't remember. I, I don't know how to do these. Like, how to do the killing mission. Nico, man. I'm going crazy. Since I got out, things just don't make no sense. If things ever made sense... They made sense inside. Three meals a day, time in the yard, lockdown at eight. Things out here is mad crazy. Tell me about it. On the down low, I think Playboy wants me dead. Might just let him do put a cap in my dome. End it all. That's what you want? Seriously? Nah, fuck that shit. I ain't ready to go out yet. I need you to get him for me. I can't do it myself. He was my boy back in the day. That's something I won't be able to forget. You seem like you got my back, Nico. I'll be out on this one, dog. I'll stick by you till the end. Take him out for me. That's a pretty heavy request, Dwayne. Playboy was your best friend. And he's always been straight with me, more or less. I'll have to think about it. problem, Playboy. It's yours. That said, I know what I'm going to do. That right. You cold, Nico. Peace and love. Well, the Holland play. It says play, kill Playboy or Dwayne. Well, I'm sorry, Playboy. You're, uh, unfortunately to say, your ass is grass. And, uh, you know, we had some good times, man, you and I, but, uh, you know, I, I, I just, I don't know, something about the chemistry with, uh, you know, Dwayne and Nico, that's, that's what really got me. Like, he, he's like a real person, like a real homie. Like, I don't like, you know, using homie, but, you know, a good friend, a real friend. So, um, yeah, that's, that's what I'm gonna have to say. Because I know if you do Playboy, he gives you $25,000. As for Dwayne, he gives you Playboy's house, as well as you get the Nico suit. I mean, not the Nico. You get the Claude suit from GTA 3. And you know what? I uh, I want the suit. I want that cool-ass uh, outfit. Because um, you can never go wrong with uh, Claude. I really should play GTA uh, 3 one day. I have the Definitive Edition as well as the Regular Edition. So maybe one day, maybe after I beat GTA 4 and, you know, have more time on my hands, I'll consider it because I, I have a lot of games on the backlog that I just really want to get out of the way. But that definitely is going to be one. Ew, Playboy X. <laughs> Yo, Whitey's back. Yo, what you doing? You got rid of Dwayne already? I thought the old dog would have put up more of a fight. <laughs> I didn't kill Dwayne. Well, what you doing back here then? Step to it, motherfucker. Well, I was thinking that maybe Dwayne is not the problem. Maybe it's you. Motherfucker! You think you can touch this shit? You think I got here by letting little bitches like you fuck with me? I own you! Nobody owns me! And another shootout. See, unfortunately with Dwayne, it's just a casual, like, back. Like, like, look at the flowers kind of stuff. And unfortunately, we're gonna have to go through a good old, uh, shootout to get Playboy. Uh, let's see. Yay! <laughs> uh boy. Uh this is this is a uh, this is gonna like I don't know. I'm kinda conflicted on this. The fuck who's shooting? Alright, so at least uh we got him. I I don't know, some reason I feel like there's another person in here. But I I don't know. 
it sucks, but you know, life happens. Even if you kill me, you're gonna have this whole town after your ass. Oh my god, a parkour sequence. Come on, Nico. Oh shit, no shit, oh shit. Yep, that well, that was my stupidity. It almost looks like Nico was dabbing. Well, he has like one health left, and it's like, there's not much you can really do, man. I'll just make it quick and painless. Shit! I'm gonna fucking die! Yeah, I know. It's okay. Rest easy, man. You were a cool dude, but... Yeah. Dwayne! I dealt with Playboy. You should know that he asked me to end you first. He was going to pay me a lot of money to do it. Shit, man. He was a good kid back in the day. Always hungry, though. Always wanted more. Maybe I should have seen it then. Kept a closer eye on him. You can't predict what people will become. You're right. I can't give you no money for helping me, son. But I got the deed of Playboy's fancy silk chic law. You can have it. Hey, man, I seen where you're living. You should take it. Nah, you'll make me remember the kid too much. Maybe you'll stop by my place sometime, though. Hang out with me. I don't have many friends left, you know. I'll give you a call sometime soon, Dwayne. Later on. Now we have Playboy's Loft as our own business, which is pretty awesome. So, now that being said, it looks like we have some other stuff to do. Because we still have Elisabetta, and we also have our uh, lawyer service. You know, I I do want to become a lawyer. So let's let's see what we can do with the lawyer, and then we can actually call uh, Elisabetta. See what's going on with that. You have reached Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister. All our personnel are busy making this city a better place. If you have a complaint about a high-ranking official, please leave your details after the tone. Well, I guess not. Come on! I need uh, that that sucked because uh, I actually hope to do the uh, that one. But let's uh, let's see what Elizabeth needs. Hey, man, this is getting out of control. The police are all over me. I can feel them. So? So? So, so, so I'm gonna go to prison for a long time, <laughs> so my life is over. Oh, God, all this work for nothing, man. Uh, uh, being tough in a man's world. I guess I wasn't so tough, huh? Oh, hey, turn states. Everyone's a rat. Not me. <laughs> Whatever. Open up, man. Who is it? It's the streets, man. Okay, hold on. All right, man. Oh. This is what Manny's oh. all about, man. Manny, 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 Manny. Now, man. word up, bitch. You better stop slinging that shit on my streets, yo. We don't want it anymore. Hey, OJ, you catching this? Rolling, what rolling. Is this, Manny, for fuck's the sake. The streets have spoken. Now leave my people alone. Hey, Nico, what are you doing here? Oh. I'm not in the mood for this right now. Well, he said he was going to bust the dealer. Can you help me clean this mess up? There's a doctor and broker who can help. Come on, let's put him in my car. Oh. 
There is uh, no way that uh, the these guys are going to be okay. You literally shot them point blank in the head. There is no way in the actual hell that they're going to be okay. Uh, it definitely has been a very dark episode so far. Killing Playboy, uh, Manny and his cameraman getting killed. And, yeah, and then Elizabeth's going to jail. So, this has been uh, a rather ordeal today. This is a very, very dark one. I definitely did not expect it, and uh, I definitely don't want the car to, you know, be exposing them, because that'd be actually kind of terrible. Oh, fuck! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, ah! Uh. Oh, that, that's what I was worried about. Oh, my God. Lord. That is horrible. Come on. Oh, my God. How how am I supposed to? Yep, 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 yep. I figured that was going to happen. Yep. some bodies in here. I've heard you'll take care of them. Uh, natural causes? Of course. Seems like a bullet in the head is as natural as it gets in this town. They weren't sick, were they? No. Had a few problems with sick bodies. No one wants a liver if it's riddled with tumors, huh? Know what I mean? No. Shit. Looks like the bullet went right through this one's eye. And the price of eyes is through the roof at the moment. <sighs> Fine. Can I leave you with these or what? Sure. I'll have these organs out on the street in no time. They're yeah, gonna help a lot of folks. <sighs> He'd been trying to help the streets his whole life. Maybe he'll actually be doing it now. Well, that was definitely a dark turn, and, uh, yeah, so, yeah, Elizabeth, so there we go. The doctor has that stuff. God, one last thing to bother me. The heat is closing in, Nico. This particular party is ending. Well, I guess we'll go see what uh, the that question mark is, and then we could go from there because uh, this has been an interesting video. Definitely dark, but hey, at least Manny's uh, organs are gonna be, you know, gonna be good. Read about a hot day. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. I wasn't gonna call Brucey because Brucey's cool, but nah. Just to call Roman, because he needs to know what's going on. Well, I guess not. But, there is a taxi. And, you know, me with taxis. I feel so bad, because I, I know, like, this whole entire, like ordeal is just me taking taxis and not even using the money for anything good because it's like there's a lot of things that you could do with it so i also saw there was a pedestrian over there we could do that later but for now we're gonna uh do the question mark this is it thanks you and me is depriving the women of liberty city of the hottest bodies out baby let's go for a drink man sorry man I can't go drinking right now. I was just getting jacked up thinking about hanging with you. Shit. Another time, bro.
not in the business of caring about people's feelings, bud. Yeah? Boo fucking who? Hey. Hi. Listen, I know what you must be thinking, but don't bother. I'm sorry, but I don't see how you know what I must be thinking. You've killed people. <sighs> you should be dead yourself. Or inside. You're just lucky it was me and not someone else who got their hooks into you. I'm sorry that I lied to you. And, and weirdly, in some ways, you're a nice guy. Better than the creeps I normally date. But you're damaged goods. No doubt. Let's go. In here. Salute? Eat my ass, buddy. I'm up for the promotion. What the hell are we doing here? We're going to meet someone. Sounds fun. You know, you and your cousin, you should get out. What you're looking for, you won't find. Feds are all over it. Crime is done. You've watched too many movies. Whatever you say, Michelle. Or whatever your name is. It's Karen. My name is Karen. Interesting. And you whore for the government. I kind of like the honesty in that. I have a clear conscience. How very lucky for you. <sighs> In here, Office 396. Hi there. Here he is. I can see that. Thanks, Karen. Hey, cheer up. You did good. You'll get a Sammy, if you care about that sort of thing. Thank you. So, Mr. Bellic, quite a file, quite a story. Who are you? If I be? If I be? Do I look homosexual? Do you think I care about the size of your Johnson? Now... You can't always tell who the good guys are. I'm not a good guy, but I'm fighting with them. And guess what? So are you. Hooray. That's the spirit. Nothing like a bit of sarcasm when someone's got you by the balls. Now, I need you to find something out for me. Find out everything you can about a man called Oleg Minkoff. He lives on Iroquois, back in Hove Beach. And if I say no? I hand your file over to those cretins in the FIB, and organized crime has dealt another serious blow. Go to his house. Any problems, call this number. Hmm. What's your name? Not relevant. Call me. Very soon. Go. And hey. Welcome to America. Pascal Stardejava. Bushka. So his name is the UL Paper. U uh, that's such a weird name, but um, not gonna bitch about it. But uh, I shall be taking your vehicle, uh, good madam, and other madam. Sorry. Should probably like I don't know why people just kind of do like that. Like it always reminds me of like Saints Row when they do like the hijacking and stuff, and they never hop out of the vehicles. It's just kind of interesting. But hey, it, it's kind of cool though. Like, like at least a guy is probably like multi, uh, like, like knows how to speak different languages. Like, being multilingual. A coworker of mine, he speaks like four different languages, and that's just pretty cool. I'm just glad that we, you know, all that craziness and mishap is kind of over and done with on the game. Just kind of chill. Cause that was uh, something else. My God, this this lady needs to just jump. Just get out of the car. If you're if you're that terrified, just get out. Cause this is just causing issues. All right. So let's see. What do we have to look for? Not love me. Death at a diner. Oh, that that was me. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um. Let's see. Nope. Not the news. Nope. Uh, let's see. Anything? Crap list. <laughs> like Craigslist. I'll tell you, I, I've I've dealt with some stuff from Craigslist. Uh, definitely interesting stuff to say the least. 
course, nothing. Does he have any emails? Something? Yeah, we're right here. Alright. Trace. And Larry. Anything? There's an email that says he's meeting someone at Tulsa Street in Hove Beach. Perfect. I'll send someone to pick up the hard drive. You go to Tulsa Street. Eliminate Minkoff. Whoa, killing is very different from gathering information. You are acting in the interest of your new countrymen and keeping yourself out of prison. For once, this is a murder you don't have to feel confused about. Dispose of Minkoff, then call me. Alright, I guess we have to go to the jewelry store and go from there. I'll, I'll tell you, I don't like motorcycles on this game, but it's the only reliable one right now, and, you know, I could use the other vehicle that we did have, but... You know, I'd rather just, you know, risk pain and suffering like I typically do on the motorcycle. See, it, the motorcycles on this game is so much different compared to, like, GTA V, which are so much better. But the stoppies on this game are phenomenal. Vasily, thank you for coming. Oleg, you me. I even thought you were a Все, он меня дожидался. Пока, братан. One thing I don't like about the motorcycles, very floaty, very crap. Definitely wish, you know, they're they were just a little bit different on like like the driving mechanics on this game because god they're they're just awful but uh i really hope that there's you know not like too much going on oh fuck let's see can i at least get him you know oh god Stupid freaking vehicles! Oh my god, he's getting away. No, please, no, no, Oleg. Oleg, no. Oh god, I really hope not. Minkoff is dead. The country is safe. Not by a long shot, smartass. Nothing is safe. No one is safe. Maybe something has been averted. Maybe delayed. I'll be in touch. Goodbye. Hey, at least we did it. Hooray! But, uh, I cannot remember which house is Playboy's. Wait, this is it. Over here. All right, cool. I think we'll go to Playboys and then save from there. And then, yeah, that was um this episode because, like I said, I definitely did not expect it to get this freaking dark. Man, I'll tell you, Oleg's car is actually kind of fast, which is nice. Very uh, refreshing to have a very fast vehicle for these games. Sometimes it's not as fast as the Sultan. The Sultan's pretty sweet. I really cannot wait to get to that next island to get that thing because man the sultan's great valerie fuck oh it's a roman's girl nico i'm getting worried roman didn't get back at all last night he likes to party he stays out late the whole time you know what he's like not on my watch you know something ain't right
gold, you Patrick McCreary. You and me did some work for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to Mama's on Savannah Avenue in Meadows Park. I'm always in need of money. See you there. But look on the bright side, we got uh, Patty, Packy's uh, number now. Packy is pretty cool. He was on GTA 5, originally on here. But it's pretty cool. I can't really complain because he's just, you know, a, a cool dude. As for his father, he's something else too because I ended up finding out that Packy is related to Francis and Derek as well as many other characters of the McCreary family. So it definitely uh, is something, but not a bad thing. Here we are, the new loft, freaking uh, AKA our, our new home. And hey, our uh, fast vehicle is there. That's pretty cool. What the heck? Um, huh. I was gonna say, why is there so many people? And then I realized he lives in a like a higher end like house. Ah yes. What's up, Brucey? Nikki, you animal. The guys we raced the other day want a rematch. They liked your shit, man. Cool, I guess. Anytime you want a race, give me a call and I'll hit you up with a location. Peace, man. This is my computer. I feel like such a loser. I'm so ugly. I'm so stupid. Never learn. I need a tutor.